I'll admit, that's nifty. Hey guys, so this is my review of ARK. This is a Netflix original. Originally, I wasn't going to see it, but mainly because it looks like a different version of Groundhog Day. And the only two times I've ever really enjoyed a Groundhog Day premise is obviously Groundhog Day and when they did it in Supernatural Season 3. However, right off the bat when you start this movie, you already notice something's going on and it's as though they're jumping into the middle of it. And I will admit, this movie had me. In the first few minutes, I was already hooked. I was cooking dinner, but I swear I was like this, stirring the pot the entire time. What this movie is about is about a guy who wakes up with this girl, these guys come in and attack him, and then they tie him up, and what he's, they're trying to steal stuff from him, or that's what it appears to be. And what he is, is he's a military engineer who's made this thing called an arc, which is an ever-turning turbine that provides uh, limited less energy however it is also creating unlimited time loops and the thing that I like the most about it is basically the kind of the tag on is that he's not the only person who's going through this and that's what I enjoyed that as well as the world building we obviously find out that the world is in a form of disarray apocalypse corporations basically taking over the world stuff like that and it's subtle However, this film's main aspect is the, between the two characters, the main guy Renton and the girl Hannah. Renton looks like a discount version of Arrow. Uh, he was actually really good. He's an engaging character and what we're going through, we're seeing this guy who lives with past regrets. And however, there are a few issues. It's kind of irrelevant to say, but this film kind of follows patterns <laughs> in terms of other main story narratives. There are a few things that I was able to see coming, but admittedly this film is very engaging. You will be in it all the way up until the end. And that ending, I'll admit, I even said, Aw, man! Like, now it's not, don't take that as a bad thing. I actually did enjoy how it ends, and I would love to see this guy make something more. The director had a really cool vision. Everything down from the house to how they were living to the technology itself. It's subtle, and I enjoy that aspect. And Orc overall is a very engaging movie. There are some parts that I admit I didn't see coming, and it's a very engaging, despite the fact that we're seeing the same thing over and over again, as well as we're seeing a storyline that has been used several times before, it is very cool to see it being taken in a different direction, where as small of a direction change as it is, it still is very cool to see it be done this way. So in the end, I'm gonna give ARK a five out of seven. It's an engaging film. It's about, what, an hour and 30 minutes, and you will be hooked, Alan, I guarantee it. You will be hooked to this movie. Anyway, guys, that's all from me. I'll see you guys next time.